Certainly, it's costing us all more to put a meal on the table these days. Good evening to you. I'm Nikhil Williams. And I'm Dan Schaefer. Tonight, we wanted to see about possible savings at farmers markets and how government benefits might be used there. We sent Way 31's Alex Torres Perez to get the answers. Alex, what'd you find out? Well, you might expect those better deals uh, to, not at the grocery store, but it actually depends on where you shop. Sometimes you find those better deals at the farmer's market. This. Tomatoes and candle. The Green Street Market is a weekly routine for some. I would choose the market over the grocery store any day. But quality isn't the only thing driving more people to the farmer's market. Shoppers told me they're not seeing a big difference in prices at the market compared to the store. If you actually price it out, it's the same or better to buy it here. It all depends on the store you go to. I definitely cannot compete with Walmart prices. Yara Barker sells meats. Sometimes she offers deals to shoppers at the market that wouldn't be available at the store. Not only that. You get actually fresh produce here versus something in the store that's been stored for several months. Shoppers say they can find better deals on fresh produce at the market, especially if it's in season. When strawberries were in season, this was the cheapest place to buy them. When looking at actual prices, the gap isn't as big as you might think. For example, a dozen eggs cost $5, while farm-raised eggs in Target, Kroger, and Whole Foods are all more expensive. But if you're looking at a store's generic brand, eggs are cheaper at the store. Still, shoppers say they're willing to pay the extra cash. I like supporting the farmers, though, and it just tastes better coming from a farmer's market. It's so much fresher. It's not sitting on a shelf or having been frozen or whatever they have to do to get them in grocery stores. People who receive SNAP benefits can also double up their money at the market thanks to an Auburn program. It will double up up to $20 in benefits for fresh fruits and vegetables. So this is a, not only a place for them to get a good deal, but this food is all local, fresh, nutritious. So if you're making your grocery plan, shoppers and vendors ask that you keep your local farmer's market in mind. Come out, we'll, t we'll take care of them. Well, farmers and vendors told me they are trying to keep those prices as low as they can for you, but because of the rising costs in seeds, fertilizer, and lack of labor, some of them may have to rise their prices. Reporting live in Huntsville, Alex Torres Perez, Way 31 News.